Hello my lovely Pisces, how are you loves? Welcome to your weekend reading. This will be for Sun, Moon, Rising Signs and Venus Science. And yes, it's a weekend reading since I've been inclined to do this reading as we are moving into a new season and that's the Scorpio season. Mysteries resolved and as well, there's a lot of things here you might not be aware of. And as well, Piscean, keep in mind, we're still in Mercury retrograde till November 3rd, and it's also in the Scorpio zodiac sign. But that being said, loves, let's hear what we have strongly for this weekend for you. And what are those energies playing there for you? We have go for it. There's something here you need to go ahead and work on. And underneath we have a wedding. Woof. All right, Pisces, you might be connected with a, a Capricorn. I feel here I got the Capricorn energy with go for it energy. But here we are. Your prayers and positive expectation have been heard and answered. We've been working with you on this situation since its genesis. And we continue to watch over you and everyone involved. Stay on your present path as it will take you very far indeed. And the wedding energy here is very much like there is something here in regards to a commitment or a commitment you want to make. Doesn't need to be a marriage necessary. For some of you, you want to propose to somebody or you feel so. Or there's something here like move forward. But definitely here, it's something here about a commitment you want to do or you want to go for. And a small announcement for you, Pisceans. For those of you who want to participate in the giveaway for November giveaway, a free reading. The emails will be accepted only those emails being introduced in the comments of that video look for that video and as well i start working on the november readings will be posted next week and in the november readings what you need to do is like share and comment how you feel about that energy what your feedback could be and as well to be part of this family as a subscriber all right, Pisces, let's hear what we have for this weekend and how this energy flows for yourself. As you always know, this energy could be way bigger than just a weekend. Seven of Wands. There's something here you, you try to stand up for yourself or for a situation. Ace of Cups. Knight of Wands. Four of Wands, Seven of Swords, Chariot. All right, we have three sevens here, including the Chariot is now number seven, Major Arcana. There's something here you, you try to prove here, but there is some somebody here doesn't believe or there is not quite honest for what is offered or whatever you offer them that might not be what they are looking for or whatever they offer to you might not be something here you know set in stone so definitely here there is something here you you want assurance and that's the thing in here it's like do i have the assurance we can move forward or we just playing any games in here let's see here Aries energy, Emperor, Three of Wands, Seven of Pentacles. There is a waiting time in here. Nine of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, another seven. We have all the sevens here, my loves. And as you know, the seven is a very spiritual number. Page of Cups. It's kind of like, I don't know what to do i don't know what else to do here nine of swords two nines six of pentacles i want balance i don't know if this is a balanced connection or not you definitely here dealing here with a 
with the Aries Sag could be a Leo as well. But it's it's something here this person wants and doesn't know if they want because it's like it's like I'm not sure I'm not sure if it's good I'm not sure if we're moving directly where we need to I'm not sure if this is you know for us and you might feel like you know a little small there is some difference of age here for some of you different of opinion this person might even resist your love and that's a red flag here for you Piscean because you really want to go forward with this connection but this person feels like well I want more or I want in a certain way like they are very very specific in some some things in here and you you might not know clearly what they want and right now you are just like I need clarity I need it's like there's so much into your mind like you feel like maybe they they have somebody else maybe they there is something here in the middle they're not telling me so there's a lot of confusion in here for some of you you might live at the distance from this person and you might want to go forward and talk to them but also what I'm feeling here this person might be married prior and they may not look for a marriage or for for something here real commitment because as you see here this knight of wands is going away from this four of wands Pisces so this person is some somebody here who it's kind of that that flying bird they like the the things you offer but always is very could be a very picky person or there's always something here about this person very very heavy connection what I'm getting for you and for a couple months now and like you you don't really know I thought it's something here I'm I'm offering it's good but now I don't know so if you really want to go and clear the energy with this person I feel here you need to but I feel here this person could be a very complicated person or very much you know picky I, I pick the energy of picky energy seven of cups here eight of swords you, you don't really know what to do else you took your time and now it's like well I I've been thinking quite a while for this now I gotta forward I gotta move forward and this cannot be in this place anymore and I swear to God to you Piscean I'm not sure why but I feel that I have a deja vu energy here it's like I've been done this reading one more time or this energy is coming very much one more time since I do see this so definitely here you you want to clarify the situation you've been thinking enough and you don't feel great in this situation yeah this person here it's like if they drag the time it's because they've been hurt prior okay and it's kind of they hope that they will move forward Leo energy here they will go forward definitely here there's something here in regards a connection or a stable connection okay if you want to give and take go for it and talk with this person yeah definitely fire sign energy here Aries Leo Sag person but I definitely see here this person could gone through a lot so they don't really know to go ahead or not with this connection 
because I feel here there is something here. Let me put it here. Something here didn't make them happy at all. They could have gone through a separation. And it's not the thing here, this person doesn't want something stable. Because they do. But it's kind of they're afraid to. And it's not, it's not this because of you. It's because of them. They are the one who is here and there. But I feel here that it's kind of... I don't know what to do best, but I, as I will see you and will have the talk, the things will start rolling over there. But I feel here you, Pisces, dealing with somebody who gone through a lot. And I don't feel you gone or you, you've been through what they've been through. They all will overcome whatever it is here. But it's kind of they need more time. And the thing is, you don't really know if you have the enough time. You might not understand them like, why, why you refuse my love? I'm not here to hurt you or anything. But I feel here that's a fear they are having. But I feel here as well, your positive energy might lift them up. Let's see here, one advice. One advice for you, a lovely Pisces. Six of Cups. There might be children involved in here. Queen of Cups, give them that love they needed here. Five of Cups. And Eight of Pentacles. Also, it's kind of that person feels abandoned. They could be an orphan or something here. It's like they they gone through and I feel here you are the one who can help them to go through that. And that is the past energy. Could be somebody who who've been in orphanage, could be somebody who've been abandoned by their father, could be something here, they gone through a divorce or separation. That was something here in their past, which was very much like a big no-no. And you are here to help them. But it's clearly you don't see whatever was out there. So Spirit says, focus on the good. Focus on the things you you've been doing for the best because you are the best thing they can have at this time okay and sometimes you know just being present for that person will make them a stronger person so yes lovely pisces this is what i got for you love and light to all of you see you next time weekend reading blessings have an awesome and abundant weekend ahead Namaste.